Siberian Husky left ear with pass and swelling for many weeks. This swelling appear to be a growth or an abscess growth in the vertical wall. So the owner went to see vet one. Vet one suggested uh, that uh, this surgery should be referred to vet two. But he contacted me, and uh, I suggested a vertical ear canal ablation. The dog had a big hardened vertical canal. After two weeks of antibiotics and anti-inflammatory, as you can see, the swelling has gone down to this size of about 2 cm times 2 cm times 1 cm on the vertical wall. After the removal of two-thirds of the vertical wall and this lump, which uh, Dr. Tanner thinks is an abscess, I would say that uh, only a histology will tell us whether it is a tumor malignant or benign or an abscessed tumor on histology evidence. So this, this uh, lump or this growth will be sent to the lab for analysis today. And uh, this is a rare case of a husky with vertical ear canal tumor or growth. This is taken 20, 20 hours after the surgery yesterday by Dr. Daniel. It's a called vertical ear canal ablation uh, to, to uh, remove this swelling. The original condition was that the dog kept scratching his head, kept scratching his ears and uh, there was a foul smell for several weeks on the left ear. <coughs> July 18, 2014, 9 a.m. Stop by your vets, Singapore.